This is going to be our forward skip series, really focused on good arm drive and knee drive as you go forwards and backwards. Here's our crossover skip, turn the hips as you go forward, really getting good rotation. Take the foot behind you when you're going backwards. Angled skip is great to loosen up the ankles, still focus on good knee drive, good toe drive. Stay squared up as you go both forward and backwards. For lateral skips, don't allow the feet to cross. Emphasize knee drive and toe drive. Crossover skip is just like the front part of the karaoke. Pull the knee up and over, getting good rotation on the hips. Back crossover skip is the back portion of the karaoke. Turn the foot and reach back. Be sure to get good rotation on the hips as well. Knee tuck stretch, pull the knee up tight to the chest, stay in a good posture. For the quad stretch, pull the heel to the butt, reach the opposite arm up high into the sky. For the Frankenstein march, drive your opposite foot to opposite hand, stay in a good posture. Shin grabs, grab your knee, grab your shin, pull up towards your chest. For side to side lunges, step out wide to the side, push your hips back behind you, keep one side straight, one side bent. Be sure to focus on the toes straight and feet flat. For pointer stretch, drop down to the opposite foot, reaching with the opposite hand. Try to keep a good posture in the upper body. For three way ankle stretch, line up against the wall with your back leg straight and back heel flat. Rock your hips forward towards the direction of the front foot. Do all three positions, straight ahead, across the foot, and angled. Three-way hip is a great hip mobilizer. We have three different movements here, shoulder to shoulder. Just take the knee, the distance from each shoulder to shoulder. Knee driver, staying in good posture, drive the knee up and toe up towards the chest. Open and close, take the knee across the front leg and open the hip up. Our mini band series is a very important part of our warm up. We're looking to activate the hip muscles as they're important in strengthening knee stability. Our first exercise is monster walks. Take an athletic stance with a wide base, take small choppy steps as you go forward and backwards. Be sure to keep the toes straight. Next up is lateral walks. Take a big step with, followed by a small step. Again here it's important to have toes straight ahead. Next up is our athletic knee knocks. Okay. Start in the athletic position. Drive one knee in and push out against the band. There should be no other movement outside of the knee drive. Do 10 reps on the left knee, 10 reps on the right knee, then 10 reps on both knees. Many athletes struggle on single leg balance, so we find it important to practice it as often as possible. Here we'll do a set with our eyes open, and then a set with our eyes closed. Anywhere from 15 to 20 seconds is a good range to, to start for now. Our moving jump series is a great way to improve body control and coordination. Here we're going left to right, be sure to stay in athletic stance and keep your toes straight ahead. For the forward and backward jumps, take a big jump forward, small jump backwards. Going back, Take a big jump backward, small jump forwards. Twisting jumps, turn the hips, getting good rotation as you're moving forward and moving back. At this stage in the warm up, we're looking to get a little bit more movement. Be sure to alternate your change of direction so you're getting both sides equally. Forward run to stop is a great deceleration drill. Make sure the athletes stop in an athletic stance and hold for two seconds to, to reinforce good position and posture. In T-step transitions, be sure the athletes set their foot perpendicular to the direction they're trying to go. 